Well, it is June 20th. <laughs> I should always remember this day because I got my new stem cells, my stem cells. I got a pack of regular cord cells and then I got a pack of expanded cord cells. So we're, this is the new protocol that we're, they at the hospital, I say we're, well, yeah, they're using me, so we're trying out. Um, it was uneventful. A lot of things like beforehand, I had to have a lot of equipment hooked up to me. They're checking things, make sure you're not getting a fever, blah, blah, blah. And um, so I had a ton of stuff connected to me. And it went fine. Um, they give you Benadryl and Tylenol just in case you have a reaction. So um, I had that, um, which made me kind of... And <laughs> so I got both of them done without incident. So that was good. Um, learned a little bit that I do how many bags they give you consist of how many stem cells are in each bag. So my cord that I got to use was had overload of stem cells, so they only needed one bag. So it was cool. The expanded cord is different. It is made to take care of me before the step the new stem cells take and take in. These expanded ones are supposed to cover that period of time with my immune my immune system. So that should be pretty good. Um, let me see. Anything else? The nauseousness is not going away. It went away a little bit yesterday. It's back today. Um, however, you know, getting all these new things put in my body. So um, now we're kind of on the lookout for, um, you know, no infections. Can't have that. So wa or washing hands, mouth care, and um, not being around people that you know, are sick. And today my sister brought me Mr. Hedgehog. He's <laughs> He's really cute though, isn't he cute? He's like perfect for me. I can squeeze him. So that's my present for today and my daughter's group from work, they were so sweet. They all signed a card and took a picture and sent that to me. And that was really nice. It's nice to know that they support her. You know, because she's going through a lot, too, with all of this. So it's nice to hear that. And um, other than the nausea and everything, that's been the worst. Um, I feel weak, but that all revolves around the nausea. I can't eat, so it's hard to get up and walk. So, bleh. And this dry mouth thing. Oh, my God. I got some biotin for it. I can't not wait to get off whatever I'm on because it's miserable. <laughs> that's almost worse than the nausea itself. So, um, everything's on track, the way it should be, um, I'll keep you posted, uh, we worry about, I was just looking at the calendar, we worry about infection, um, it could happen, it happens to most people, so um, I won't panic if it happens, um, they're pretty good here about getting you a pretty good protocol about what has to happen, if you have a fever, you get a chest x-ray, they take blood from your ports and from your uh, regular vein that doesn't have a port. They have all these precautions they take. So, and I saw that with my last time when my hips hurt and they took care of that. So we know they will. And have a beautiful evening. Um, I'm glad I finally got this in today. I haven't been feeling real hot today. So, so I took a couple out of and I'm ready to go to bed. <laughs> so I hope everything is well with you all. And thank you for joining me.